Here we go. Here's the matchup. This is the matchup. Ravoon feels better, right? Yeah, it just gives us a much better curve. Which is deck, like, some games feels like a Leona deck, some games feels like a Heimendinger deck. Chances are super low of actually finding the early game though. War Mother's Resonance Sleeper? Kind of. Kind of, yeah. So Flash of Brilliance is now 3 mana. Also buffs up Tri-Beam. End the round. Take the Traveler. Do you guys think he blocks with it? Nah, good man. I got seven for his trundle. Ah, we play Leona here. Alright, you can't really play Ice Quake here. He can't really actually play Ice Quake into this. You can play Avalanche. I was looking for the deck, but I realized it was Diana Lee. Yeah, Diana Lee sounds kind of good. May as well double proc here. What is this? Withering Whale? Holy shit! Didn't expect that. I should have expected that. We're playing War Mothers, not Trundle Asol Ramp. Jesus. God, I can't even sunburst it now. Ah, oh, shit. I guess I'm just forced to do this. Nah, he's got Trindamir in hand. You wouldn't let that die if he had answers, unless he has Trindamir. Yeah. Well, I have a T-Rex. I don't think this deck runs, um... I kind of just want to slap Sunburst into the Trindamir. I don't think they run Glimpse Beyond. Maybe I can stall the game out. God, would he actually atrocity this into one of my units? Yeah, they run Atrocity, but that's not going to go to the face, is it? He'd want to clear the Heimerdinger. Holy shit. This guy is a madman. I shouldn't have done that. That was such a fucking dumb play. Yeah, what's up, man?
silence this round. Sick. I'm literally forced into this play, I think. I can't allow him to like atrocity plus attack with that. That's going to be an issue. That's a bit of a high roll. Holy shit. That crocodile has come out of nowhere. He might have another atrocity, so it won't matter. Streamer luck. Yeah, apparently. That happened to me one time in the past when people first started playing Tribeam. Why this player? Is he scared of my elusive tyrant? No, he probably wants to push more damage. Probably wasn't correct to use the uh, Pale Cascade there. He's only got one Beholder card in hand. Wait, are we still in this game? And do I need to put more healing into this deck? I can't really fit the healing in. Some games it feels like I want some more healing. Some games it feels like I want some more like late game. It's it's really interesting. Probably. I've literally only got Guiding Touch. It makes me just want to like take Guiding Touch out and put Star Shaping in. However, Guiding Touch does work sometimes. Like Guiding Touch hits, it hits Heimerdinger, it hits my face. The fuck are you swinging with the Warding Stones for? So we can, like, so we can do this. Okay, fair enough. It's one extra point of damage. What the fuck? If he had troll chant, he would have just swung anyway. We might be winning this game, actually. I might straight up be winning this game. That's gonna feel fantastic if we do. I, I, I thought we were done, man. I thought we were fucking done. Come on. That's a fucking... That's fantastic. We even got a little bit unlucky. But we made some bad plays too, though. Like, I think uh, using the Sunburst on the Trindomir, like the way we did, was actually kind of Pepega. I forgot all about um, Vile Feast. I actually used, I did try and draw into my get excited though to try and outplay that. Hmm. I'm going to continue to work on this deck though. I, I don't know. Diana Heimerdinger does sound pretty interesting as well.